I mean, talk about what you saw on the ice. You know, just you guys got off to a really hot start, and then, you know, the wheels kind of fell off a little bit, but you guys brought it back in. I mean, just talk about what you saw. What did you see? I saw a team almost fall off the wheels. <laughs> you, you know, it, it, was, it, it was a battle tonight. I mean, we're playing uh, one of the best teams in the country, obviously. Uh, they have not lost in their last 11 hockey games. Uh, so we knew it would be a battle and that, you know, whether you scored or not, they were going to continue to press. Uh, we took advantage of some early opportunities, but, and then we got, we got a little bit sloppy, things that, uh, you know, shouldn't happen. Obviously, some of the penalties that we took uh, were not good ones, and we've discussed that and realized that we need to, to change some things that way. But our compete level, guys stepping up, our penalty kill was outstanding when we needed it. Uh, I actually really liked our power play. I, I thought our five on three was outstanding. I mean, uh, what was important there, and obviously you want to score, but the other thing is to sustain pressure and come out of that in a real positive emotional state, and we did. We scored after that because of the pressure we'd had on the five on three. So um, some things to work on, and uh, we'll talk about that. But you know, our 20th win tonight, winning on a Friday night, which is our goal, now we need to win on Saturday night. Uh, Taylor Fleming didn't score a point tonight, but ends up plus four and just kind of had a heck of a game. You talked to about his performance. I, I, I thought Taylor Fleming was a warrior tonight. Uh, I thought his, his compete level, his one-on-one -on -one stick battles, his physicality, uh, getting the puck down the ice when he had the opportunity. Um, I thought Taylor was, was outstanding. And I don't give out a lot of bouquets to players, as you know, because this is all about team. But I thought he was a real warrior. And I came in here afterwards and I said, any pro scout that's watching this game here has to look at Taylor Fleming and say, this kid can play. Just talk about some of the things you really liked out there. You, you did get outshot, but it didn't kind of seem like a lot of them were that from that dangerous of areas. You, you know, I actually liked our defensive coverage tonight. Uh, I thought our ability to kill plays down low in our zone was pretty effective. A lot of their shots were from the outside on the rush, but I mean, let, let's face it. I mean, uh, they're a team with a lot of quality seniors and junior players and some great players. And some of the top players in our league play for Minnesota Duluth. So to think that it's going to be easy or we're not going to have scoring chances against. I mean, they, they're a really good team. They competed hard. They're going to come back at us tomorrow night again as well. They got a lot of pride, and uh, tomorrow will be a real battle as well. The one thing I want to say, whether, whether the question gets asked or not here, I, I thought our marketing department here and uh, our administration did an unbelievable job here tonight of uh, filling the building up with the fact that we didn't have our student body here. They're all away in spring break. and. We adopted a lot of lunatics tonight, and a lot of older people were acting like lunatics, and that was nice to see. Thank you, Coach. Thank you. Yeah. Um, just talk about the play tonight. I mean, it just seemed so fast in the first period, and then you guys were able to jump out to an early 2 nothing lead. Yeah, I mean, it was a playoff-type game tonight. Uh, it's a good team over there. Uh, we jumped out to the lead, but I feel like we got sloppy in the third. Um, we came out with the victory, but there's a lot of things to improve on. What are those things you need to improve on? Uh, obviously, staying out of the box. That hurt us. I think we had four or five penalties in the third alone. Uh, you can't be doing that to have success in this league. Things get a little hairy there for you in the third period. Can you just talk about how you guys kept your composure? Yeah, you know, it's tough. Uh, physical game. Um, you know, a lot of big bodies on the other team, and we got a lot of big guys, so obviously things are going to get chippy coming down to the wire. But I think that going forward, it's just going to get, you know, more and more it's going to be a big boys game. So obviously we need to work on keeping our composure and staying out of the penalty box. But uh, I think our penalty kill and a lot of the older guys really stepped up in those last couple of hard minutes there. Thank you. Yeah, no problem.